Billy was always fascinated by trains, ever since he was a little boy. His love for trains started with his Thomas the Tank Engine toy set, which he would spend hours playing with every day. He would build tracks, set up bridges and tunnels, and create elaborate stories with his beloved trains. As he grew older, Billy's interest in trains never waned. He would often visit train stations and watch the locomotives roll in and out, their wheels clattering on the tracks. But no matter how many real-life trains he saw, he could never shake his love for his old Thomas toy set. One day, when he was in his early twenties, Billy decided to dig out his old Thomas toy set from the attic. As soon as he found the box, he felt a wave of nostalgia wash over him. He couldn't wait to set up the tracks and play with his old toys once again. But as he started to set up the tracks, he noticed something strange. The train seemed to be moving on their own, as if they had a life of their own. Billy thought it was just his imagination at first, but the more he played, the more he realized that something was very wrong. One day, while he was playing with his Thomas toy set, he heard a faint whisper coming from the trains. He couldn't make out what it was saying, but he knew it was something ominous. The whisper grew louder and louder, until he could hear it clearly. Come closer, Billy, the whisper said. I have something to show you. Billy was terrified but he couldn't resist the urge to see what was happening. He leaned in closer to the trains, and that's when he saw it. The eyes of his Thomas toy train were glowing with an eerie green light, and its mouth was twisted into a grotesque smile. From that moment on, Billy was never able to play with his Thomas toy set again. Every time he tried, he could hear the whispers growing louder and more sinister. He could feel the trains watching him, their eyes following his every move. Years went by, and Billy grew older. He had long since forgotten about his old Thomas toy set, but the memory of that fateful day stayed with him. He had always dismissed it as a figment of his imagination, but deep down he knew there was something more to it. One day, Billy decided to do some research on his old toy set. He discovered that the company that made the toys had a dark history, and that there had been reports of strange occurrences associated with the Thomas toy sets. As he read more and more about the history of the company, he started to piece together the truth. The Thomas toy sets were cursed haunted by the spirits of the children who had once played with them. And now, those spirits were reaching out to claim another victim. Billy tried to forget about the toy set, but he couldn't shake the feeling that he was being watched. Every night, he could hear the whispers growing louder and more menacing. He knew he had to do something to break the curse. One day, he decided to confront his fears and destroy the Thomas toy set once and for all. He took the box out to his backyard and set it on fire, watching as the flames consumed the cursed toys. But as the fire burned, Billy heard a loud, guttural voice behind him. You can never escape us, the voice said. We will always be with you. Billy turned around but there was no one there. The voice echoed in his mind, haunting him for the rest of his days. He knew he had made a terrible mistake, and that he would never be free from the curse.